Hey guys, welcome back to my channel and today we're going to do another look using the Too Faced Chocolate Bar Palette. We have, I think, four more looks to go maybe. So we're almost done with this palette. I've really been feeling uninspired by it the last few times I've used it because I'm getting to the point where I feel like I've used everything <laughs> that I can, like all the looks that could be created. I feel like I've created them. I'm sure that's not the case, but it's how it's starting to feel. Um, I'm sure you guys can tell I have a cold going on. Hopefully it's over with by tomorrow or it doesn't get worse. Like hopefully I start feeling better because tomorrow is Thanksgiving. It's just all right in this area. Also, chocolate stain, courtesy of my son. Hashtag mom life. And my bun kind of looks like a beret, does it not? Like it just kind of looks like a beret. <laughs> <laughs> Anyways, I've already primed my eyes and now we're just going to go ahead and get started. So we're going to set the eye primer with first row, second shade, that white color, and we're just going to pop that all over the eyes to set our eyeshadow primer. So the next shadow we're going to go in with is going to be the second row, first shade, that pretty little pink brown color and we're just going to pop that right along our crease. And we can go ahead and take that on down the lid as well. Just put it all over the eye. So for the next shadow, we're going to take a thick, dense little shader brush and we're going to go with the gold color. That's going to be the third row, second shadow. We're going to pack that guy all over our lid but we're really going to focus it more towards the inner corners um, or the inner inner half of the lid I suppose. We have other colors that are going to go on the outer part. And I think I forgot to mention this to you but I did wet my brush so I'm going to get a very intense gold color. The gold in this palette is just gorgeous. I feel like it's going to be a great gold to be using come like Christmas time. So taking a bit of a fluffier brush, we're going to go in with the second row, fifth shade in, and we're going to start packing that shimmery purple on the outer corners of our eye. We will eventually come in with a thicker brush and um, work on foiling the shadow as well. But right now I just want to work on kind of building the color on the outer corner just because when we have used this color in the past it's not always worked the best. And you can take it up over the gold, that won't be a problem, and that'll look okay. So this is where we're at right now. I did go ahead and touch up the gold a little bit because we lost a little bit of it with the purple. Um, I took the and swept the purple all the way up into the inner corners here, as you can see, if I can figure things out here on camera with where I'm looking. Um, so out in the outer corner and brought it on in above the gold. Uh, I like the way it looks. I mentioned taking and foiling the purple shadow on the outside, but I kind of like the purple smoke we have going on without having too much. We're really letting the gold be the focal point here, so I think I'm going to leave it as is. I'm going to jump off camera really quickly, finish the rest of my face, then I'll be back so we can finish the eyes. So this is where we are at currently with the eyes. I think they look really, really pretty as is. I may even do this look tomorrow for Thanksgiving. Um, just some super simple and pretty without being like over dramatic but still a little dramatic you know what I'm saying uh, but we're gonna take it a step further so we're gonna go back in with that same shader brush that we used with the gold and we're gonna pop the gold shadow right along our um, bottom lash line but we're only gonna take it into about the middle we're not gonna take it all the way to the edge Just kind of mirroring what you've already got on the top. We're going to come back in with that same purple shade and we're going to pop that along the outer corner area. Yeah. 
So this is where we're at right now. Uh, I should also mention that I did tightline my upper waterline using my black eyeliner and then I also did my bottom waterline using my NYX Wonder Pencil, which is a nude colored pencil. Just helps to whiten and brighten the eyes. So I'm also going to go ahead and pop on a wing as well. After wing is on, we're going to pop on a little bit of mascara, and I am using the Essence Volume Style Mascara. Now you can pop on lashes with this as well if you'd like, but I don't have any lashes currently, so I'm not going to be putting any on. Okay, so this is it for today's look. Thank you so much for hanging out with me. I love the way this turned out. Like, I really think I'm going to wear this for Thanksgiving tomorrow. Uh, by the way, let me know. Did you guys have a good Thanksgiving? Let me know down in the comments down below. I hope you all enjoyed yourself and spending time with your family. Um, I think this is going to do it for me for tonight. I'm going to wash my face off, get into bed. Hopefully, I can sleep in this cold off. Hopefully, it's not worse by tomorrow. Oh, the good Lord willing because I need some help. I'm just, ugh, I'm a mess. Um, but if this was your first time catching my videos, then I hope you decide that you want to stick around by hitting that subscribe button and hitting that like button. Um, but otherwise, thank you so much for hanging out with me this evening, and I will see you guys in Monday's video. Bye.